Welcome to this inner child release exercise. If you're not familiar with working from your thymus chamber, we recommend that you practice with the entering the thymus chamber recording before working with this exercise. So your inner child may only be completely healed, at least for most older energetic templates, from the higher heart. And this visualization exercise is a practice in remembering divine love from within you and practice in wrapping your inner child in this pure, unconditional love. So let us begin. Sitting or lying comfortably, please take three conscious breaths. So this is breathing in the purest light from within and without, welcoming, accept, allow, absorb all of that light into every cell and every electron of your being. And on the out breath, releasing anything that is not pure light. Release it down your pillar of light into earth. And if you haven't sealed your pillar of light lately, now's a good time to seal, seal, seal pillar of light. So we take a conscious breath, then we breathe normally in between. Take another full deep conscious breath, inhaling the ideal purest light. Welcome, accept, allow, absorb that light. And on the out breath, letting be anything that no longer is ideal for you. Any energy that's ready to leave, let it be. And one more conscious breath, breathing in. Ideal, purest light. Welcome, accept, allow, absorb all of that light to every level of your being. And then exhaling on the out breath, all that is no longer ideal for you, all that is ready to return to earth. Now we say the soul mantra. You can say aloud or to yourself. I am the soul, I am the light divine, I am love divine, I am will divine, I am wisdom divine, I am power divine, I am divine design. You say that two more times, I am the soul, I am the light divine. I am love divine, I am will divine, I am wisdom divine, I am power divine, I am divine design. I am the soul, I am the light divine, I am love divine, I am will divine. I am wisdom divine, I am power divine, I am divine design. Now call on your team in spirit, your soul and your monad to guide you in this work and welcome any other guides who join you. With every breath now, as you breathe in and tune into divine love, allow the statement, I am love divine to move through you. And as you move into your thymus chamber and take a seat on your golden throne of divinity, sovereignty and power. Call on Archangel Metatron to bring in liquid golden light to seal your thymus chamber, sealing walls and floor. And continue to breathe in and out, holding the intention, I am love divine.
So now we could state intentions for this exercise. And these are the intentions. I am that I am is parenting my inner child as his divine ideal. I am that I am is parenting my inner child with unconditional love from divine wisdom as is divine ideal and as is in alignment with divine will. I am that I am is 100% accepting and unconditionally loving my inner child in every divine now moment forever as source decrees. That's D E C R E E S. So as you sit on your golden throne of divinity, sovereignty, and power, allow the thymus chamber around you to expand and become gradually bigger in size. It may be small at first, and that's okay. But whatever the size, let it gradually expand with unconditional love. You're radiating unconditional love from within your God self until it is bigger, the chamber is much, much bigger than you are. Continue to inhale the purest light and exhale any energy that is not pure light, keeping your attention focused on unconditional love. And if it helps, Keep thinking on the in-breath, I am love divine, and on the out-breath, I am love divine. <sighs> now call on your younger inner child to join you here in the thymus chamber now. Allow your inner child to come to you in whatever age is ideal in this divine now moment be it as young as an embryo or as old as an eight-year-old. Keep your attention steady and focused on unconditional love. And in the space in front of your throne, take your inner child in your loving arms. Hold them with your gaze, your smile, your posture, all in unconditional love. And bathe yourself and your inner child now in a continuous stream of unconditional love through your breath and know that divine love is pouring through you. Feel the both of you surrounded by the pure unconditional love of the divine. If you feel tightness anywhere, breathe light into it and allow it to open up with your intention and with the streaming of unconditional love. If tears come up, let them flow. Let them be washed away with the light, keeping your attention on unconditional love. All that comes forth which is not unconditional love is now ready to be released. And as you breathe out, let this be. Keep your focus on unconditional love. Stay steady in the light, breathing in purest light, and with every exhale, expanding unconditional love and let the breath wash away whatever may not be love. Now from your higher heart, set this intention. I am that I am radiates pure and unconditional love unto one's inner child in every divine now moment forever. 
And as you say this intention, see your inner child's higher heart receiving unconditional love through a pure channel of pure light and pure unconditional love flowing between your two upper hearts. And as you say this intention, see your inner child's higher heart receiving unconditional love through a pure channel of pure light and unconditional love that flows between your two upper hearts. You may tune into the color of this light to support you in whichever color it appears to you. Or if you don't see any color, call in pink and white light to support you. And keep focused on this flow. Focus on this flow now for a couple of minutes allowing for your experience of unconditional love to become stronger. This flow between you and your inner child's higher heart, connecting the two higher hearts, is now established and will, will remain so for this incarnation. When you feel complete, or when you are guided to, we stay in this consciousness and return to daily activities. We recommend that you practice this meditation until you can feel, sense, know or see that the connection between your higher heart and the higher heart of your inner child is in divine ideal. And you'll know when that is so. And if you're not sure, ask for guidance. So when you become tight or critical or judgmental with yourself or others, take a moment to pause and breathe into your higher heart, inviting unconditional love to flow through you. Thank you for listening.